Welcome back to Riding Bikes in San Diego. We're on Fairmount, and usually I take you on this ride where we are crossing this exit that goes on to Aldine, and we would cross this to get back up to Mead, which has the uh, bike path and infrastructure and bulb outs and uh, traffic circles and all those things. This is not a safe place to cross, though, and usually... We just do it, but I want to take you up this hill, and usually when we cross it, we do better than, I don't know if you see the sign right there that's been knocked over, but uh, we're going to do better than that. Today, we're going to take this ride, but instead of staying in that green bike paint, we are going to veer off to the right um, and head on up the hill. Why would somebody want to do this? Well, Mead is convenient if you're going to City Heights or if you're going to places mead or to the south but sometimes we want to go other places sometimes we want to go to adams avenue because adams avenue has all the businesses it has multiple markets and restaurants um, cafes different kinds of stores uh, on this particular day i want to make a stop at one of the stores on my way home uh, my wife asked me to pick something up from the market as i'm heading home i don't want to bike more blocks south and then have to turn around and do those same uh, blocks back north. I don't want to add you know a half a mile or a mile to my ride. If I'm going to climb a hill anyway I might as well take this big old hill. So you know as you saw it got narrow there and then this little bit of buffer shows up on the side which is fine. We're going to be in it and there was a sign that says that the lane narrows and that we need to share the road but I'm going to go slow on this road because it's a gnarly hill. It's like straight up. Um, but I love that little thing right there. I was looking at it. Uh, maybe I should go back to that. I was thinking what if that construction there was actually like some kind of staircase or ramp that went up the hill that I could just stop, carry my bike and bring it on up or walk my bike up. But it's not there. That's not what they're going to do with it. That's somebody's private land and um, we're going to go. The last time I looked it up, I haven't looked recently, but all the land off to the right was actually for sale. I think Caltrans was selling it. Like, good luck developing it. Um, you'd have to somehow build it out. They don't want to build it out to somehow make it safer, but that's okay. This little shoulder that we're in gets more and more narrow, and of course, now we get a couple of faded sharrows, and we're just going to slog up it. Um, it's steep, but like I said, this is where we need to go. Also, if anybody's biking and wants to end up in the neighborhood of Kensington, this is the most direct route. I wish there was another way to get up to Kensington, but there's not. At best, there's the bike path over that runs along the 15, but you can't get there from Montezuma West. We did a video on that a few weeks ago. I, um... I thought maybe I could I'd salmon back around. You can get there, but it takes some doing because the path is not designed to actually get you there. A couple of drivers are going to pass us. No incidents, nobody's honking. I think that everybody understands that this is difficult. Um, there is a little uh, speed sign coming up that will tell us, I think, that we were doing um, a, a brisk 8 miles an hour on this. Yeah, look at that. I'm cruising on 9. I hit 9 miles an hour on this thing. Um, I'm riding a touring bike. I'm not riding uh, an electric bike on this one. If I were riding an e-bike, though, I don't think I'd be going more than, you know, 15 miles an hour anyway. Um, it's steep, but I'm also not in a hurry. I'm going to get up to the top, and then I'm going to turn onto Adams Avenue, and I'm just going to go where I need to go. I wish there was more access from lower elevation to higher elevation. One of the problems San Diego has is providing access between places like Mission Valley or Fairmount or um, you know any of these low-lying areas back up to the Mesa. We did a video a few weeks ago. I meant to show you uh, a choice between Presidio, Washington, or Bachman. I ended up choosing Presidio that day but they're all steep, they're all narrow, they're all putting us in competition with drivers, and, um, and it's just not great. That house on the left has some box turtles living in the garden. It's kind of neat. Um, when we make this right here onto Adams Avenue, the street widens out, 
parking begins and uh, there's just the double yellow in the road it looks to me like there's plenty of room to put in some paint for bikes and to increase safety but we'll leave that to the good people of Kensington and from there we're going to drive less and ride a bike thanks so much